All right, we are awake and I feel completely rested, which is lovely. We have our nice little boat. It's protected us all night. We only had a couple enemies come walk up to our backside and then just wander on off because they couldn't get to me. Isn't that convenient? Anyway, we've made our little campfire. Now we just need to cook some recipes and we will be good. We'll cook some meat. Lovely, lovely. Let's go ahead and put that in our inventory. Let's take some of the dirt off of there. We'll take this off of there because we're not going to use it off the top of our head. But if we run into a boss, I don't know. I wonder if we can put this actually over here, can we? Nope. Okay, that's fine. I didn't think so. I think it was just for... Uh, Make some sauerkraut. All right. And then we'll make some bread. Loving it. Got some carrots for stewed carrots. Must be standing near. I don't know what the difference between them is other than maybe they give us more food. Which is good. But, uh, in case we got that. Sweet. Then let's see what we got here. Um, you're going to need a base of operations. Find a location and fill it with devices. Dig up some co cobblestone, craft up in place a forge, and place a workbench. Okay. You have learned to make torches, platforms, iron bars, and workstations, and some blocks. Good to know. Let's get all that going on, and we will... Oh, that bread's nice and tasty. Go handle these guys. You want some? You want some? I'm gonna reload, sorry. Yeah, get him, Scully. They didn't expect you to come at him. Anyway, we're going to attempt to get this cobblestone over here. And I wish there was an, an easier way like in uh, Terraria where it just kind of dug in front of you. That would be handy. Yo, it's going well so far. I think, I hope there's a floor here. I'm going to make a torch. There we go. Just take some wood to make some torches. That's nifty. Good to know. Getting some nice cobblestone here. Takes a while, which is annoying, but I'm sure we'll speed up with it the better materials and stuff we get. Maybe even leveling up makes us mine faster. I'm not really sure. Oh, hey. Yeah, get him, Scully. Show him who's boss. That eyeball doesn't know what's happening. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Those guys are freaking out up there. dig into the ground here. Later, if we have to, we can extend this into our base. Who knows? Now that we've made it this far, got to finish off our house here. And uh, probably put a door on there so things like that don't happen. Because we can make doors now, apparently. Uh, apparently, I can't put wood behind where the campfire is, so maybe I have to pick it up. I don't know. That's weird. I don't know why I wouldn't be able to do that. We'll pick it up. Finish this off. Then we will put it down again. I do wish I could see past this. That is a little odd. I wish the uh, UI was kind of in the corner. Kind of like in Diablo. Because it would be a little better for just placing things out of your inventory. But that's alright. I'll get used to it. We'll put it more towards the front door here. So I can sleep in the back. Feel a little safer there. And then we can build ourselves a door, a small door. Take some woods. Must be standing near a handy workbench. Okay, we don't have a workbench yet. But let's see what we can build. Can we build a workbench? We need two iron bars. And then to build a furnace, we need 20 cobblestone. Okay, we're getting there. But we can make a soft bed. And I uh, need a workbench for that as well. But we will make a soft bed, so... Everything's going well. Going all right. Our house is... Nice and amazing. You can kind of see, like, as you look at it from at the side as you go, it kind of looks 3D, which is kind of neat. I like that. Um, go ahead and finish getting our cobblestone. There is a drop-off here, which I'm a little worried about. And that fell in the drop-off, of course. We're game about killing monsters and stuff. When you're up above the ground and the uh, little casual music's playing, it's a very peaceful experience, for sure. Just mining away and building and stuff. I'm sure it's not what most people want to come see when they see this game. But, you know. What you get. What you get. You get a nice casual pace at the beginning. And then I'm sure it ramps up to just get crazy later. 
Another drop off right there. Uh, I don't mind a drop to actually get down, but probably. Oh, I can crouch. I don't know how I didn't notice that before. What I should do is if I can make those platforms. I don't know how expensive they are to make, but I know I can make platforms. Uh, it just takes one wood per. Okay, we can do that. So, can I just go down it like... Yeah, okay. No problem. Easy peasy. Might have to clear this out a little bit. I'm a little too fat. That's fine. I'm not really planning on going too far down here, but it would be nice to have for later. So we're going to go ahead and do that and put a little torch down here so we can see. Good to know. All right, then we can get a little more cobblestone and we'll create our furnace and we will continue onward with the quest line that they give us here. All right, now we should have plenty of cobblestone and we already grabbed some of that because, you know, it's there. We got a tree right growing. Right. Oh, well, good job, Scully. You exterminating all the vermin in the house that's didn't expect anything less from you anyway let's see where is our uh there we go we'll make a forge how big are you uh you're pretty large but you can't put you right next to the campfire unfortunately so we'll just put you right here we're gonna have to extend the house unfortunately i planned on extending it anyway i just didn't expect i'd have to extend it so soon and this iron bar it takes iron ore of course which might be that down there so we'll go ahead and go handle ourselves some iron ore reload that handle ourselves a floating skull as well yeah here pig man shoot me with your gun rude oh these take quite a while to mine it's okay I'll just grab all these up and then head back to the house and probably sleep for the night because you know nobody ever wants to be out here during the night time it's just just no fun just no fun too too spooky gives us a good excuse to rest up on our character anyway oh i'm now hungry oh gosh I fell in a hole. A hole I didn't realize was here. Good to know. Alright, we can double jump on out of there, so not a big deal. Just grab this real quick. Oh, don't fall in a bigger hole. Hey, don't drop bombs down here. Grab this iron ore. Don't want to drop it. Or lose it. Ah! Too many little spiders. They get overwhelmed. Let's get out of here. Get out of here, eyeball. Where's Scully? Did you kill Scully? I killed Scully, I think. No? And where's Scully at? Where'd you guys take Scully? Oh, there he is. all of you. Oh, what'd you drop me? What'd you drop me? Another one of those scrolls of power? Yeah, another blessing scroll. Nice. Okay, well, hopefully our food doesn't go bad over time, because that would suck, but right now it's looking okay. We can go ahead and nom up on some uh, stewed carrots. That sounds good. And it has become nighttime, like I said, but before we go to bed, let's go ahead and make some iron bars. Let's make all of them, in fact. All of them we can, even though we might have needed the iron ore for something else. I doubt it. Um, now we can make our handy workbench and an anvil. Maybe not both. Maybe. No, we can't make both, but that's okay. We made this one, and for now we can't put it anywhere because my, our house is not large enough, but that's okay. We'll go ahead and probably head out tomorrow and grab some more wood and just... Just get the casual grind out. You guys won't see much of that, and then we'll go ahead and extend the house... Come back then, hopefully extend it pretty large, but who knows? Who knows? We'll just rest with all these spiders on our house, unless they come in here. 
I have to kill these stupid eyeballs, aren't I? Just stay in there, Scully. It's safer. You couldn't, you couldn't leave me alone. You had to help me. Ah, that hurt. What hurting? Ooh, is this a health potion? I really need one of those. Okay, going in my house now. I'm gonna nap, because I need energy. Okay, well, I got enough energy. Time to be on our way to grab some wood so we can extend our uh, humble abode and actually make some progress. Still eyeballs showing up at the middle of the night, but that's okay. A resting job healed us without having to use a potion, so good to know. Oh, another potion. Well, why, thank you. I haven't realized this, but on our slight journeys here, I'm pretty sure I've gotten a level up. In fact, I apparently have two level ups. Nice. Uh, of, course an oh, of course, an enemy is coming at the same time over here while I'm trying to level up like usual. Just can't leave me alone when I'm in the middle of doing stuff. Uh, what do we want? So this gives our resistance rating up and this gives us some more mana, which is nice. More health, of course, is always good, but damage multiplier could probably be pretty good. It gives us 5% damage. Not bad. How much mana does that give? I don't know how much mana that gives until I say okay. We're just going to get one each, and we're going to see that gives us exactly one mana. And the other one gives us 5% more damage, which is good. More mana is good, but not necessarily useful right now. Like, uh, a bigger clip's nice. Uh, having more of my skulls would be good, if that's possible, Mr. Scully's, but... We need 500 gold, however we get that to acquire that. I don't know if there are traders or if we have to make houses for traders, kind of like in Terraria. Um, of course, Terraria is pretty unique, so if it had something similar to that, that would be interesting. Ow! That boy just follow me, or did I just jump into that? Oh, it started raining on us. I jumped into that again. I'm just letting them kick the crap out of me at this point. Grab that potion, and we will just use one real quick. Also, eat some sauerkraut, because why not? Oh, our XP bar is over on the left there. I think it's that green one. Pretty sure. It looks like we're about to level up again. I'm not sure what the yellow one is, orange one is. Maybe that one's the XP. I don't know. One of them's the XP, I think. All right, well, we had our nice little journey outwards to go gather. Uh, nothing really eventful happened other than us, of course, leveling up and a couple of enemies attacking us, but nothing too crazy. They didn't drop anything. They dropped us another scroll, of course. We have three of these scrolls now. I picked up some more iron, so we're going to go ahead and make some more bars, which is great because we needed a couple anyway. We'll make all of them we can here. Throw them in our inventory, and then other than that, we should be able to make... Our, uh, we already made our handy workbench. It's in our inventory, so now we just need to make the anvil. We'll throw that in our inventory as well until we extend the house, and then after that we will go ahead and build a bed. But for now, we're just going to rest, because of course it's a night time, and then we will build our house tomorrow and continue on from there. All the eyeballs don't even know what to do with all the walls here, so... And, uh, luckily, our good old buddy Scully handles all the little guys, all the little little guys while we're in here sleeping, which is good. He's quite the, quite the handy little buddy. I even got a level up while sleeping. Look at that. 